Many celebs are paving the way for social advancement, helping fans understand there are a lot more ways a person can identify themselves and their sexual preferences than as just heterosexual, homosexual, or bisexual. Here are some stars who've declared their pansexuality, a romantic attraction to people regardless of gender expression, gender identity, or biological sex. If you're heavy into Australian television, like say you're from Australia, then Caitlin Stacey is a familiar name and face. She's appeared in the internationally known soap opera Neighbors, as well as the acclaimed comedy drama Please Like Me, just to name a few credits. In 2014, a reporter from the LGBTQ news site After Ellen interviewed Stacey on the red carpet for the GLAAD Media Awards. When asked if playing gay characters felt different from playing heterosexual characters, Stacey said it doesn't and she has a quote, fluid sexuality herself. When explicitly asked if she identifies as pansexual, Stacey emphatically said yes. Yeah, it's not a big deal to me. I don't really discern a difference between attraction for men or women. American reality TV star Natalie Negrati, who made a name for herself in Big Brother, came out as pansexual during an episode of MTV's The Challenge Final Reckoning that aired in July 2018, telling the world, I am pansexual and I'm okay with that now. Negrati also told the Watch With Us podcast that it took her 28 years to come to terms with her pansexuality, but she decided to reveal it to the world in hopes to, quote, educate people who are not informed. In a post on Instagram, she shared that accepting herself as she is has helped give her the chance to blossom into the person she is today. Courtney Act, whose birth name is Shane Jinnick, rose to fame in 2014 by starring on the fabulously iconic reality series RuPaul's Drag Race, making it far in the show's sixth season. Act later joined the UK celebrity Big Brother, which the performer won in 2018. Speaking to Attitude magazine in 2018, the Australian opened up about being pansexual. The reason I identify as pansexual is not because I wander around the street looking at women thinking I want to bang them. It's because I've had sexual and emotional experiences with women, and I don't count that out as being a possibility. Act added that strict ideas about sexual preference are narrow-minded. We have such a rigid idea of what heterosexuality is and that's problematic. We have such a rigid idea of what gay is and that's also problematic. American actor Asia Kate Dillon made TV history by portraying the first gender non-binary identifying character on the small screen, playing Taylor Mason on the Showtime drama Billions. Dylan identifies as gender non-binary in real life, making The Orange is the New Black star the first openly gender non-binary person working in television. Dylan explained to ABC News in January 2018, "...non-binary is a term used by some people, myself included, who feel that their gender identity falls outside the traditional boxes of man or woman." Speaking to HuffPo in April 2017, Dylan shared, "...from the time I came to understand sex and sexual orientation and all of that, I've identified as pansexual and I've always felt like I had the spiritual, emotional, physical capability of being attracted to any gender." When I was growing up, if there had been someone like Taylor on TV, it would have really meant something to me. Brendan Yori was a bona fide rock star with dramatic stage presence and terrific hair. By the tender age of 19, that's when Panic! at the Disco, a band he formed with some childhood chums, hit the top 10 and won the MTV Video Music Award in 2006 for Video of the Year for I Write Sins, Not Tragedies. The band has since fizzled. Yori is currently the band's sole member, but he's gone on to star in Kinky Boots on Broadway and earn a loyal following in the LGBTQ community. Yori, who is happily married to a woman, came out as pansexual in a 2018 interview with Paper. Yeah, I guess you could qualify me as pansexual because I really don't care. If a person is great, then a person is great. I just like good people, if your heart's in the right place. I'm definitely attracted to men. It's just people that I am attracted to. 